Little Lou and the Woolly Mammoth by Paula Bowles. Little Lou sat on the floor, surrounded by an enormous muddle of toys. She was bored and she wanted a friend to play with. Suddenly, something colourful wiggled past her and disappeared into the muddle. So Little Lou dug down amongst Owly Owl, Sock Monster and Stripey Whale and found the loose end of a long woolly thread. Being a curious kind of girl, Little Lou decided to give it a tug. But the thread wiggled away, so she followed it instead. It wound around and around, it looped up and down, and it twisted and tangled in lots of knots. Little Lou followed the thread overhead and around the bend until finally it ended in a monstrous tangled mess. What could it be? She gave it a tug and another and another and then she heard a snort and she felt a shake and then a shudder. The big woolly tangle slowly stretched and little Lou saw a huge pair of ears, two blinking eyes and one long trunk. It was an enormous woolly mammoth! The size of a boss and weighing a ton, little Lou thought it best just to run. She dashed this way and that way and all over the place. And the woolly mammoth chased her in a zigzag race. Stompity stomp, stompity stomp, went his footsteps behind her. His feet were big enough to squish her, his trunk almost long enough to catch her. But as they zigged and as they zagged, the woolly mammoth got snagged. Stompity stomp, stompity stomp, and he began to come undone. And what do you think? He then started to shrink and he got smaller. Stomp, stomp, stompity stomp, and smaller, stomp, stomp, and smaller. Pitter, pat, pit, patter. He was tiny, cute and cuddly. But little Lou squealed with delight. The tiny woolly mammoth ran away in fright. Wait, come back, called little Lou. And they zigged and they zagged until they could zigzag no more. And then the poor woolly mammoth trembled and shook as little Lou bent down and picked him up from the floor and gave him a great big snuggle. Why, they were both just lonely and in need of a cuddle. So little Lou and the mammoth each had a new friend. And who knows what else they'll find the next time they follow a woolly loose end.